In this video, we will learn about Java private key encryption. Our program will encrypt and decrypt using a private key, a symmetric key. It will first generate a private key based on the AES algorithm and then encrypt and decrypt a clear text message. And our code will also display the private key information. First, I will import Java security package and then Java X crypto package. Import Java dot security package and import Java X dot crypto Then I will set our algorithm to AES. That will be static string of an AES. Then I will have a static key and name it key. And then in our, uh, I also need a cipher. So I will add that one too. Need to remove this extra key and add static cipher and name it cipher and then move to our main function and then I have a key and we will create this key or generate this key by calling key generator key generator method get instance and pass in our algorithm and then we are going to call generate key function to get our key and and I need to catch an exception I will just add over here that means throws exception and then I will use cipher and call cipher method get instance and pass in our algorithm that AES and then we need our text that we want to encrypt and decrypt so I'm just gonna and string and that will be my name it's gonna be a semicolon I want to encrypt my name and then I'm going to call encrypt function and get the encryption bytes I need to define the encrypt function for that and after main function I will define encrypt method that will be private and static and it will return byte and I will name it encrypted to encrypt it and string that will be my input string that we want to encrypt and inside it I'm going to I'm going to add a code for cipher and we will initialize by calling it init method so cipher dot init and pass in cipher dot encrypt mode we are doing encrypt encryption so I need to pass cipher dot encrypt mode and then our key and 
then I will have a byte array that will be my bytes for input bytes and then I will call input dot get bytes it will return the bytes of encrypted tag uh, the text that we want to encrypt we, I will convert the input into bytes and now we are going to return the bytes of encrypted text by calling cipher dot do final method and pass in our bytes the text we want to encrypt we need to also catch perception i'm just gonna add here we this function to perception just making things simple now from my main function i can call this encrypted method so and get our uh bytes uh, encrypted bytes so i will name it byte array and encrypted bytes and going to call it in and then pass in the name that I wanted to encrypt so this function will return us uh, encrypted text as bytes so, and I will print it to console system dot out of print line our in encrypted text and that will be let's call this function and print out the value and now I'm going to add a decrypt function to decrypt our text back to the original form so I'm just gonna add a decrypt function after encrypt Oh, this function will be defined as private static string and this will decrypt the text and return a string back so it takes byte encrypt bytes and a throw exception And in this function, I need to call cipher, cipher dot init, and then cipher dot decrypt mode. Because we are doing a decrypt in this function, that's why I pass cipher dot decrypt mode, and then byte. And I will name it recover byte and then cipher dot do final and pass in our encrypt bytes encrypt bytes and just going to convert into string original text and this string and pass in our bytes we cover bytes and then just return our original text string so this is simple
now go back to my main method and then I'm going to pass in this encrypted bytes and get our decrypted text system dot out dot print y and our decrypted text and just call our decrypt function decrypt and pass in our encrypted bytes I will also print our key so we can see what our key is print line our our key that will be should be a guess that and here just and over here I will call key dot do string method to get its value as a text and I'll just need to run our program here is the output for our program and we can see over here our encrypted text and then our decrypted text in the original format so this way we can use private key to encrypt and decrypt in java to keep on learning please subscribe to my youtube channel keep supporting me and thank you for watching